The tent is the cornerstone of the campsite. If pitched correctly, you've got a solid, water-resistant fortress set against the forces of nature. It's an easy task to perfect with a tiny amount of practice. Step 1. Prepare. The first step is to select a level campsite. Make sure to pick a site that is clear of rocks and branches. Get someone to help you if possible. Position the tent with the door facing the desired direction with the door unzipped and open. A good tip is if conditions are windy, don't place the door of your tent facing the wind. A good tip is to lay out your poles on the ground before beginning assembly. Assemble the main shock corded poles. That way you'll know which poles are the longest and which are the shortest. Next, if the poles are color coded, make certain to insert the poles through the corresponding sleeve. Now go to the opposite end of each pole and gradually apply pressure to the pole, forming an arch. Insert one end of each pole onto the pins on the corners of the tent. Next, stretch the corners of the tent until they're tight. Hammer stakes through the rings off of the pins. Attach the frame clips on the seams to the frame poles. Step 3. The rain fly. The fly will serve to keep moisture from pooling directly on the top of your tent and carry any dripping water away. The fly can also serve as a shade on the top of your tent on a sunny day. Now drape the fly over the tent, making sure the fly is properly positioned. An appropriately located fly is one where the seams on the fly align with the pole structure. Attach the pole to the fly using the hook and loop tape already stitched on the underside of the fly. Then stretch the elastic loops at the corners of the fly and hook the clips onto the corresponding rings at all corners of the tent. Step 4. Guying out your tent. Attach the guy out lines to the webbing guy out line attachments on the fly. Lengthen the guy out line using these sliders so you can stake the lines into the ground. You need the seams to align with the pole structure. Tighten or loosen the guy out lines as needed. Step 5. Enjoy your tent. The work is done. You can now move on with your outdoor activities knowing that you've got four walls and a roof waiting for you when the day's fun is done. Step 6. Tear down and storage. Make sure your tent and rainfly are dry. Neatly fold the tent and rainfly, making sure all the air inside the tent is pushed to the opening. Make sure that when folded, the tent is no wider than the bag holding your stakes and poles. Roll the tent tightly and place it in the carry bag. Make sure the tent is dry and clean before placing it in the bag. If it is not possible to fully dry your tent while camping, be sure to dry out your tent before long-term storage by pitching your tent at home and allowing it to dry. Congratulations! You now know all you need to pitch your tent like a pro. From Coleman, the outdoor company. The tent is the cornerstone of the campsite. If pitched correctly, you've got a solid water-resistant fortress set against the forces of nature. It's an easy task to perfect with a tiny amount of practice. Step 1. Prepare. The first step